Good. We here at 18 News are also looking into reports that a number of dead fish continue to wash up on the shores of Seneca Lake. Our 18 News reporter Joe Mason also joining us live in the studio to go over what's causing this. Joe, what can you tell us? Jackie, in recent weeks, Seneca Lake has been filled with hundreds of dead fish along its shores. I went to Seneca Harbor Park this afternoon to take a look. If you've ever spent time in downtown Watkins Glen, there's a good chance you've stopped at Seneca Harbor Park. The park sits on the shores of Seneca Lake. Many visitors take their families and pets here. But recently, the shallow waters neighboring the park have been filled with hundreds of dead fish, leaving many to ask, why are they dying? We reached out to the New York State Department of Environmental Conservation for answers. They say, quote, the DEC found a common parasite and a bacteria contributed to a large fish die-off in Seneca Lake. Fishery staff collected samples after being notified about the lake-wide die-off. Samples were analyzed by Cornell University College of Veterinary Medicine and determined to be caused by Chylodinella and Aromonas hydrophila. Neither have human health impacts. A similar die-off was attributed to Chylodinella in Seneca Lake in 2017. No significant impact to fish population was noted in the ongoing incident. The DEC encourages anyone that encounters a dead fish or has any questions to contact Region 8 Fisheries at the number on your screen right now. Jackie? Thanks, Joe.